I've got another short little video for you guys. Uh, I just thought I'd do a small comparison basically between the FF, sorry, the FF4 Firefox, little HID, uh, that's 60 watt, and I measured it at 5700 lumen. Uh, a great little light, actually. And then recently released is the FF5 Firefox, a bit bigger, so I'll show them together. So, there you are. So a little bit of a size difference, but yeah, both great little torches, I really do like those. And then I compared it with my TM39 uh, Nightcore, which is a fantastic light, but this is kind of what the future kind of looks like. It's, it's a really good torch, very capable. Um, yeah, it's got the, the screen, lets you know everything that's going on. I've done a review on this already, so check it out when you when you have five. Um, now with the FF5, sorry I'm having to read this off my paper, but uh, I measured that at 11,425 lumen. That is legit. Um, it says, I think it's like 100 watt ballast, but I don't know if I've ever seen a 100 watt bulb, but I've seen 70 watt, and I do know that when using a 100 watt ballast, they push 70s very hard, and you get the light, it's just that the bulbs don't last for as long as what they should, because they're being driven so hard. But this thing held up and did well, I'm very happy with it. But anyway, uh, I just thought I'd do a quick review, a bit of fun, um, and show you what they look like, sort of like old school versus new school. Um, HOD and LED. I don't have a LEP that would sort of be this, this big at the moment, but you never know what's in the future. Anyway, take care, enjoy, enjoy the video. And like and subscribe. If you see this, I, I hate to sound like every other YouTuber, but I would love to grow my channel. I would love to be able to talk lights to everybody. Oh, forever. I, I just can't help myself. Um, so yeah, if you like it, um, yeah, thumbs up, like, subscribe, tell people, ring a bell, whatever you got to do. But anyways, just enjoy. Take care. Bye-bye. Okay, so I've got the FF4 Firefox. It's letting him warm up. And then if that's going on high, drop it down low, then hold on. And then it'll go to, that's the highest, that's 60 watt. Lights the place up just fine. Very capable. I do enjoy a good HID. Amazing. Okay, now bear with me, I'll turn that one off. And then I'll go to, this is the FF5. Now, this is 100 watt. And I can't say that the bulb is 100 watt because they, I don't even know if they exist, but the ballasts do. And I tested this one today at 11,000 lumen. This is actually legit. It's amazing. Great beam profile. Those trees are just there in the center of view, 200 meters, and not an issue. You see the bugs now. Trust me, there's plenty of mozzies too. That's amazing. Great color, it's four to 300 Kelvin. Okay, now, sorry, I'll get the TM39. Okay. And then there's your TM39 with the SBT 90.2 LED. And again, yeah, these are these are purpose built. 
easy to throw. Yeah, not an issue there. I do know the HIDs are rather power hungry, but they still throw a fantastic beam, and I really do think they're a fantastic light, especially those two by Firefox, well done. But uh, the TM39 is an incredible light, and this is what the future looks like. So if you were to purchase any of these lights, you would not be disappointed. Okay, thank you.